curious about what steps go into getting approved for a mortgage? Let me tell you more. Hi everyone, welcome to another Two Minutes with Mike. My name is Mike Rennick. I am your host for this video. My guest today is... Don Bartolomici. Don, just stop for a second. I'm looking at the, the camera interface here. The sun is starting to come out. It's a this typical, is, typical day. This is the last video we're filming today <laughs> and now the sun is coming out. So it's just the way it is. So um, Don, tell me more. What are the steps? Yeah, you know, I, 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 borrowers, I, I'm sure you often wonder what happens in that black hole after you give all the paperwork and you start your mortgage process. So let me just explain very briefly. There are four parts to a mortgage. So as we pull back the curtain, there's your credit. It has to be uh, underwritten and reviewed. There's your income for qualifying purposes. And then you need your assets because we need to know that you have enough cash available to close. Is and it then the liquid fourth, assets or all assets? Uh, well, we're looking for liquid. Liquidity. Yeah. So it's not necessarily a balance sheet, but it's definitely the liquid. Yeah, we're looking for liquid because you need that to yeah. pull that money out for your down payment and closing costs. And then the fourth piece is the collateral, in other words, the property and the appraisal. Is it worth the value we're trying to pay for? That's it? right. That's it. So Simple as that. When it goes through <laughs> underwriting, that's the steps it goes through. Right? Those are the four items that the underwriter reviews and how we make our credit decisions. If you'd like to learn more about that, Don, how would they reach you? 941-227-7618. And if I could be of any help, 941-400-8735. Thanks for watching, everyone.